Welcome, everybody, to Tech Partnerships Unplugged. This is your host, Karthik Subramanian, and I'm here with our fabulous partner, Okta, and we have Jamie Fitzgerald, who is the Director of Product Management at Okta. We also have our own Imran Bashir, who runs technical marketing, and we're here to speak about something really exciting that we're doing with Okta across all of Palo Alto Network's portfolio. So, Palo Alto Networks, we have a world-leading platform that covers network security, cloud security, security operations, and is backed by world-class threat intelligence and incident response. We are in a position to deliver exceptional customer experience and security outcomes as a result of that. And we work very closely with multiple identity providers and especially a best of breed provider like Okta in helping our customers go on the zero trust journey. So here today you will hear about what we do with Okta, what are the outcomes we deliver, and you'll also see some cool demos of the innovations that we have co-created working with Okta. All of this will help you accelerate your zero trust journey, help you, the customer, get onto a better security posture, leveraging the capabilities of both these companies. So with this, I'm handing it over to Jamie Fitzgerald to speak about Okta, and he's gonna answer, I mean, why is identity in focus, right? I mean, everyone's talking about identity, and think identity, think Okta. Jamie, why don't you take it from here and explain why is identity in focus? What's all this buzz about identity and you know how Okta plays into all of this? Awesome, well, first off, I just wanna say thank you for having me. Really excited about this partnership and some of the really cool integrations that we've built together. Now, first off, I think it's important for us to explain what Okta is and, and why it's important for uh, our mutual customers to, uh, to, to really comprehend what it is we do, where we're going, and why we're doing this. So first things first, Okta is here to connect everything in this boundaryless world. Um, what does that mean? Well, it means that we need to provide seamless, secure authentication to all of your employees all of your contractors, all of your business partners. In this world that's dynamic and boundaryless, we need to make sure that we're providing the best possible outcomes from a security perspective without compromising everyday user experience. So I think it's important to also talk about the fact that we are enterprise ready. When I think of Palto Networks, I think of enterprise. I think of, of the best security provider in the world. When I think of identity, and when you think of identity, you should think Okta is the same. We are the enterprise identity provider. We have four nines of uptime. We are built for scale. We have over 10 billion authentications every single month. This is the type of scale that you can expect and depend on when you're interacting with Okta as, as your identity provider. Well, let's put some numbers behind that. Number one, we provide the concept of phishing resistant passwordless authentication to every operating system that you might have deployed. We have 90% faster time to value when it comes to your integrations with the different apps that you have to deploy for productivity through our OIN. Next, we have 60 plus integrations that really offer this concept of, of joiners and levers. One of the biggest concerns that our customers have is understanding that identity is a journey and we build out of the box solutions that you can consume from day one. Now, what does that mean? At the end of the day, three times faster integration with your IT systems, specifically if you start to think about M&A, this dynamic world that we're living in where organizations come together or separate. That's some of the value that you're gonna see when you think of Okta. Well, that's why Okta's great. We just launched on essentially how Palatine Networks is a really, really powerful partner. So why come together? So Karthik, let's talk a bit more about that. Hey, thanks, Jamie, absolutely, right? Now, Jamie just mentioned about how Okta, you know, helps accelerate, you know, deployment of identity with world-class identity solutions. Now, if you take a customer going through a zero trust journey, right? With Okta and Palo Alto, Okta being the ID provider, right? Integrated with our cross platforms, across XDR, across XOR, across cloud, across Prisma Access, we are able to meet the customer where they are in terms of providing an end-to-end -end zero trust solution. Zero trust is important. I mean, we live in a world of multiple threats 
And identity is at the core of all of it. Who are you? What are you? Answering all of those questions, what do you have access to? All of that comes in leveraging this partnership that we have. Thousands of our customers actually use all of these integrations. And we're proud to say that you know, with Okta, we've got you know, multiple points. We make it very simple. We meet the customer where they are in terms of their tech stack and using our portfolio for security and Okta for identity. Going on more, right? if you look at the concept of zero trust, it's quite nebulous. But the way we see it, you have zero trust for users, applications, and infrastructure. And we have got these integrations across our portfolio. And Okta can be deployed seamlessly in a very efficient manner. In addition, we also put pen to paper and co-create and co-innovate with Okta. And to explain some of the things that we do in terms of all of this innovation, I'm welcoming Imran, who will show you some cool demos. He'll also walk you through some of the things that uh, you know do a deep dive on how we exactly execute. Thank you, Karthik and Jamie. I'm super excited about this integration. This comes across many, many of our customer conversations because it's actually solving the real pain point. How do you embark customers on a zero trust journey? And as both of you said, it starts with identity, right? So I'll talk about what is the portfolio that we have from Palo Alto Networks. How does it make sense for our customers to integrate with Okta and get the real value from day one, right? So first of all, let's talk about the identity portfolio that Palo Alto has. And this is all on the network enforcement side. Like people would authenticate with Okta with strong authentication and credentials. But to take all that identity and bring it back to the platform and enforce it, that is where the, the magic of zero trust comes in. So we have been, uh, we, were, we were the market leader and innovators in user ID, which is a concept of getting identity from an identity provider and using that to write security policies to enforce access, right? Which is huge for our customers. With Okta, we've extended that beyond an on-prem IND provider. We can, we're able to solve these complex use cases of SaaS applications using SAML and many other protocols and just blend that internally. And I'll walk you through some of the demo that just makes it super easy uh, to absorb. The second thing we have is multi-factor authentication. That's also huge for a lot of customers. Now with Okta, we're able to understand the multi-factor authentication that happened bring it all the way back to our platform and enforce the policy. So actually taking that multi-factor authentication to next level and enforcing it back to the platform to enforce access, right? The third thing uh, is most of our customers use is how do you actually prevent my users or my employees in terms of pushing those corporate credentials to a fish websites, right? That's where Palto comes in. We're able to use our technology and work with Okta to get those INT and verify that you know it is an on-prem INT, it is part of a, 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 an active directory domain that belongs to the company, and just stop submissions of those credentials on a page that looks like a corporate web page. So again, huge value in terms of providing anti-phishing to our customers. The last thing I'll talk about is absorbing context. So we can also work with vendors to understand the policy objects that they have on their end, bring it all the way to our platform, and then normalize that. For example, if somebody's authenticating on the network via Wi-Fi or through a NAC vendor, we can understand that context, bring it back to the platform, and enforce a security policy. So that's where the magic of zero trust comes in. That's the magic of identity comes in, and we blend all this together to, to to enforce a practical zero trust policy. Let's talk about a bit more of the Okta integration, starting with groups and membership, right? So this is where we're able to work with Okta, understand the users and groups and their association they have in the Okta directory, bring it back to our platform in one single plane, and then push it to all the southbound platform that you see. So whether you're working on a hardware firewall, a software firewall, whether you're implementing that on a SASE framework with our Prisma Access, we're able to get that user group mapping and offer our customers the ability to go and author security policies, which is huge. One single security pane, one single policy plane, and you get the same level of protection no matter how your users are connected to the network. Right? So I'm going to show you how this works. And it practically takes a few minutes to get that implemented. So over here, what you see is that uh, this is a, a screen from Palo Alto Networks. It's a centralized console that every customer has. We call it Cloud Identity Engine. We're able to go in, click on Okta, and then punch in the credentials. You can use, you use your credentials from Okta, or you can use a service account, right? Just punch that credentials in. If you're doing single sign-on, you will be prompted by Okta for security enforcement. Do that. 
And after that, just test the connection and that's about it. So you can see that within few clicks, we're able to integrate with Okta, bring all that identity back to a firewall level and then enforce those policy. So let me show you how that works. First of all, if I go under uh, our engine, we can see that Okta is giving us all the users and identities, but the magic is here. Now I'm able to go to a security policy inside the firewall, click on the same UI for the source user, and look at that, I'm getting all the mappings from Okta. I can plug that in and enforce the policy. And top of that, apply all the security controls that comes in from Palo Alto, whether it's advanced URL filtering, uh, anything that you have that you, that you use to enforce Palo Alto networks. Now let's talk about the next big thing that I'm excited about. So far we saw that we're able to pull in identity and author security policies. But can I actually go and enforce it? Can I extend that to the authentication as well? So the answer is yes. The way this works is that traditionally you would actually go to every enforcement platform and you would start writing those complex SAML rules, which is you know metadata exchange, certificates, and a bunch of stuff that just adds to the operational side of things. So on the right side, what you see is that now Okta is acting as one single point of control. From the UI that I showed you, that becomes the service provider. We just talk to Okta on northbound, and the southbound, we can start pushing those rules automatically. So you can start adding firewalls, you can start removing firewalls all day, and we'll just start absorbing that security control that is coming from Okta and push it all the way to the firewall and force security policies. Right? Let me show you how this works. So over here, uh, we just saw that we added a directory with Okta, and uh, we just showed the users and group. But let me actually go under authentication and show how that works. So if you go under authentication type, you can simply add an authentication type as, let's say, SAML. So I'm going to click on SAML, click on that. Again, uh, I can just punch in my Okta credentials here, or I can pull a profile through SAML metadata. So what I'm going to do is that I'm just go and enter the SAML profile manually through INT provider. And it's pretty simple. You can just simple go to, you, to go to your Okta UI, copy this, that INT provider URL, and punch it here in our UI. So let's go to Okta, click on, sign on single sign-on tab, and we'll just copy this profile right here. We'll go back to our UI and just paste it and just do test SAML setup. That's it. So within a few clicks, now we also have authentication support extended all the way to the platform. So now as a user are, are touching the network, they're authenticating through the network. Our firewalls would simply redirect to the cloud service with Okta, get the authentication dug, get done, get the SAML assertion back, and there you go. You have the full access through Okta all the way. So Jamie, I'm gonna bring you in for this one. Yep. One other topic that I'm super excited about is that passwordless authentication, right? What's your take on passwordless? Well, first of all, I think it's, it's really important for folks to understand that passwordless is not only a uh, exciting concept or user experience, but there's really a, an important aspect about security when we talk about passwordless. Um, it starts off by understanding that, that passwords are the weakest link. Um, and when we talk about credential uh, theft, why is that a problem? It, the problem is that if you get someone's credentials, you get to act as if you were them. Yeah. Well, if we remove passwords altogether, that's a pretty compelling part to that story. It is. It is. Well, it goes beyond that, and I think it, it's, it's, it's really about making sure that we can um, kind of take it to the next level. NIST has defined uh, this concept called NIST uh, phishing resistant multi-factor auth. And um, with, with a new technology we call FastPass here at Okta, we're able to provide NIST-defined phishing resistant authentication um, directly from your, your machine. It is, it is seamless, it leverages your things that you're used to today. Touch ID, face ID. Um, this is how, how our end users are used to accessing their phones or their laptops. We've extended that into Okta and helped raise the security bar while providing this amazing user experience. Now, from here, we work together, obviously, yep. as we're gonna show soon, to build that experience into the flow that your end users might have as they start their day and they start their global protect journey. Yep. So, well, I'll give it back to you on that. No, thanks, Jamie. You're right, the, the biggest thing that I see, the value is the user experience, like you said. If I'm getting the same experience as a user that I'm used to going on my iPhone and accessing my personal applications, and that's extended all the way to my corporate apps with full security via Okta, that is amazing for our customers, right? Uh, so this is what Jamie's talking about, right? Pretty much, you log in once to the platform, whether it's Touch ID, Face ID, whatever you have, we're able to enforce all the security controls here with Palo Alto Networks, all the advanced security. 
And then on the Okta side, any applications that are protected by Okta, it's a seamless experience. You just get in with your face ID, with your fingerprint, once into the platform, and that's extended all the way to network authentication, to application authentication, and, and much more. Absolutely. Right? So let's see how this works. So what I have here is, is a Windows 10 machine, and I'm just gonna log in with a pin. It could be a fingerprint, face ID, doesn't matter how you set it up. And then once I'm in, uh, the network piece or the security piece from Palo Alto kicks in. So if you have a Global Protect install, it automatically launches, it redirects you to Okta for network authentication if you set up that way. And then Okta will ask you if you want to sign in with your you know, uh, single sign-on passwords. So there you go, I'm, I'm to Okta, and I can click on Okta FastPass and just sign in automatically. And the reason I'm showing you all these details is just to show you how this works in the background. The user experience is actually much more better in production, right? So there you go, I can punch my pin in via Okta and I'm authenticated all the way, right? And after that, a couple of things will happen. You'll be authenticated with Global Protect, and I'm showing you the screen uh, just to show you that Global Protect kicked in. You can hide all these screens for a user, better user experience. But that's it, you're into the network with the authentication, and now I can start accessing all the applications, all the copper resources, which are protected by Okta by using passwordless authentication all the way. Yeah, one, one other note to add to that is that not only did you authenticate to kick off your, your integration with, with Global Protect, but now your SSO has kicked off all up. So your apps, you don't necessarily even have to log in again to have access to, let's say, uh, any of your other corporate uh, or productivity apps. Yep. Thanks, Jimmy. So just to conclude, what we talked about is a seamless authentication experience natively integrated with Okta, where we're pulling security user central from Okta, pushing it down all to the security layer to enforce policies which are based on identity. The moment anything changes on INT site, for example, there's a group membership change on the Okta site, we get instant notification on our platform to go back and revoke the access or either change the access, right? And we also saw passwordless. So the user experience is becoming amazingly, uh, so we also saw passwordless where the user experience is amazing with the same level of security that you see today with the traditional tools. So I'll pass it back to Karthik uh, for any final comments. Fantastic, gentlemen. I mean, this was eye-opening. I mean, uh, audience, if I were you, I'd be calling your Okta and Palo Alto Networks reps to find out more. Because think about this, right? What Imran just described and what Jamie described, the whole better together value proposition is extremely strong. Everyone in this industry is grappling with all of these threats, and the zero trust approach is easier said than done. And we are here to help you on that journey with all of these cool technologies, integrations, and we do the heavy lifting behind it. So thanks again, gentlemen, and uh, go Palo Alto Networks, go Okta. Yeah, cheers.